bullets are not created equal. Each type varies dramatically in the energy that is transferred to a person. When the Second Amendment was passed in 1791, bullets were lead balls, capable of accurately traveling up to 50 meters. In comparison, modern day rifles can release bullets 550 meters. When a nine millimeter bullet penetrates the body, it creates a temporary and permanent cavity, damaging organs in and near its path. 5.56 NATO bullets transfer five times the energy of a nine millimeter bullet and 20 times greater than that of a 25 caliber bullet. Once inside the body, 5.56 bullets create a temporary cavity of up to 5.4 inches, or worse if the bullet fragments, further damaging internal organs. 5.56 NATO bullets and the rifles that carry them were developed for military use. Now they are marketed to civilians. The Sandy Hook shooter released 154 5.56 NATO bullets with a 100% fatality ratio for children. In the Parkland shooting, half of the teenagers struck by the same 5.56 bullets were killed. And in Boulder, Colorado, all 10 victims struck by these 5.56 bullets carried by assault style rifles were killed. These bullets are manufactured for maximum energy for severe injury and death. They are not essential for civil society.